Hey guys, so it's me, the Dark Lane, again. Um, I thought I would do a bit of a different, uh, video, if you guys remember the Amino video. And I'm really sorry to, um, quite a few people that I'm not gonna be able to do that story for a while. I'm just dealing with the Amino shit. I kind of quit Amino, and I'm getting over that. But anyways, uh, I'm doing a different video, I'm doing short videos now. I'll do them frequently on top of my animations. So don't worry, guys. Nothing is changing except for the fact that I'm actually going to be uploading frequently. You guys guessed it. Probably about three times a week, give or take. Anyways, let's get straight into the story. Now, today's uh, story is taking place in sixth grade. I would say what school or town it took place in, but it's a small town right next to the town I live in currently. So I'm not going to be doing that. But I generally didn't like this school. I only had like two or three friends. Hell, I wasn't even friends with my crush. And I still... I don't really have a crush on her anymore. But I still think she's a really cool person. She's the person that got me into Aphmau. And I used to love sitting, hell, I was so fucking annoying back then, that in choir, because yes, I took choir, I can sing, um, I would literally sit down in her seat a lot. Anyways, that's a story for another video. Um, so there's a lot of people that do not like me. Now, this is a mostly white school, mostly white and Mexican. And there are a few blacks, and most of those blacks, and I'm saying most of them, not being racist, but I'm saying most of them because most of them fled from another school that shut down after it being a crappy school in the hood. So most of them are from the hood. So you know, they're not exactly the best people to be in this school. This school wasn't good either, but it still wasn't crap. But one of those uh, people was a in particular girl that I didn't like. Now, I didn't hate her. I just didn't like her. She hated me, though. I don't know why. And she was tall as fuck. But anyways, getting off topic. Well, not really. But, um, so, it's a good day. I'm having a good day. I'm sitting with my friend Sam, but that's a joke only he will get. So, um, and we get out of lunch. So I go to my next class, and then passing period comes. And I say to myself in my head, Damn, I'm thirsty. So I go over to the water fountains, and these water fountains always had gum in them. Like, there was gum in one of them, or the other one, or both of them. So there's always gum in there. If someone's drinking out of one, that's probably the one that doesn't have gum in it. Anyways, so I go over there, I see gums in the in the one that I would usually drink out of, so I drink out of the taller one, because I'm short, and she comes up, she sees gum in there, and there's only two water fountains. She says something along the lines of, ew, as I don't remember the story exactly, but she says something like that, and then she tells me, move over, pushes me. I start pushing back, just ignore that. I start pushing it back. She has a headband, so I put my uh, hand on her head, start pushing. She starts pushing on my shoulder. I lift my hand up, grip the headband, and pull it off. Now I told the school originally that I didn't pull it, that I didn't do it intentionally. I did. Guys, don't be like me. Don't get into fights like this. If someone pushes you around like that, just report them to the school. Don't be like me. Don't be an idiot. Now, I wasn't a very good child, so I basically got away with it scot-free. But guys, even if you can get away with it scot-free, don't do it, okay? If someone really does do that to you, you don't need to fight them. I was a bit too eager to fight. I don't know why. I don't remember why. Maybe I'm neglecting to know why, but just don't do this, okay? 
So, day continues after that, and I get called up to the office. And I'm like, oh, fuck. Well, this is great. And I go up to the office, and there's a counselor, there's a vice principal. And the funny thing is, the only time I've ever met the principal was when he was, like, uh, sick at school, trying to manage all these kids at lunch so that he can talk to them. So it's the only time I've met the actual principal. The vice principal was around all the time. So I go up there and I talk to the counselor. She's like, hey there, Corey. So uh, how's it going? I'm like, oh, well, not too good, but you know how it is. She's like, yeah, I heard you got into a fight. I'm like, well, I mean, it wasn't hand to hand. She's like, well, that's still a fight. Like, well, yeah, but I wasn't really fighting. All I did was try and push her back, and my hand kind of put my hand on her uh, shoulder. Yeah, I lied. Don't lie, okay, guys? Even if the truth isn't good, if they do find out you were lying, they're going to be fucking pissed, dude. So, um... Tell him, just put my hand on her shoulder, my hand slipped up her head and onto her head, man, pulled it up. Like, well, she told us that you were, uh, punching her. Like, well, that's a lie, because I was, I didn't. So, basically, guys, I don't remember exactly how the conversation went, but... Um, I can tell you that, uh, don't do this, okay? Don't fight anyone, ever. That's a terrible idea. But, uh, anyways, guys, hopefully you get the moral from that. Uh, don't attack people because of gum in a water fountain. And don't attack people at all. And don't lie to your school, okay? No matter what the truth is, if they find out it's a lie, they're gonna be pissed. You're going to get in trouble. Just don't do it. Anyways, guys. Um, I don't know what I just did there. I think I like voice cracked and deepened my voice at the same time. But anyways, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Whether it be animation or if I'm telling a story while playing a game. You may have noticed that I looped the uh, game that you're watching the same clip again, that's because I underestimated the runtime. But anyways, guys, see you guys in the next one. Make sure to subscribe if you like the content that you see. Not all my content is exactly the same, so you can subscribe for multiple reasons. And, um, yeah, guys, I guess comment whatever story you guys want me to do next. Uh, I guess I'll just leave it to the outro. See ya.